All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Houston Rockets Daily. Elfburn Shangoon already getting mentored by Hakeem the Dream. Now, I had a feeling this was going to happen. I feel like some stuff was dropped, like, right after the Rockets drafted Shangoon, saying, like, oh, Hakeem and, and Elp are going to work together once his rookie season's over. But apparently the mentorship has already happened. And, I mean, it's it's absolutely beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. Hakeem has actually mentored guys like um, Dwight Howard, LeBron James, Kobe Bryant, and you could, you know, reasonably argue that um, Kobe Bryant implemented just kind of misdirection in in actual games from Hakeem. So this is really cool. You know, you got a 19 year old Shangun. You know, he's got the footwork. He's got everything except maybe just like athleticism. You know, I still don't really think he's the most athletic guy but I wouldn't say he's the least athletic guy looking at his stats this year they're not too bad but you would definitely like to see just some improved efficiency um, keep in mind he's only playing 18 minutes per games in the two starts that we have seen him start he played well uh, but he he deals with foul trouble and he can also be a little turnover prone just because Ideally, you want to run the bench unit or whatever unit you have out there through Shangun if he's going to be out there because his passing, he's got just great passing and he's got just a really good organic feel of the game itself. So this season so far in just 18 minutes, he's putting up about nine points per game, four and a half rebounds, uh, two and a half assists, almost a steal and almost a block per game. But then you look at, you know, he, is turning it over about twice per game so if you were to be starting getting about 36 minutes you're looking at four turnovers which is too many but um 27 from downtown you would definitely like to see that number improve i would imagine it's going to take him a couple of years he's shooting 71 percent from the free throw line so i don't think that he'll be a sub 30 percent three-point shooter for the entirety of his career but um you know, you do like to see like that one attempt per game. The per 36 stats are really where you kind of see all of the potential. Now, I'm not a huge fan of per 36 stats, but, um, you know, in, in Shangun's situation where you're like actually only getting 18 minutes per game, it, it's worth at least taking a look at. So per 36, 18 points, nine rebounds, five assists, and then almost just slightly under two steals and two blocks per game. So... You got to imagine Shangun is going to get at least, even if it isn't a consistent opportunity, if the Rockets decide to hang on to Christian Wood, um, you got to you gotta think it. There's, you know, games Christian Wood misses, or as we get towards the end of the season, you got to be thinking Shangun starts to pick up some starts at least. Christian Wood, Elper and Shangun, I think we need to dis I, we need to determine if this works or not. And I think Silas, honestly, until this point in the season, should have been testing it out all the time. The issue is, usually when Wood and Shangun are out there at the same time, the defense is not good whatsoever. I mean, both of them aren't necessarily like incredible defensive players. Shangun's definitely still getting there. We were thinking when Shangun initially got drafted. We were thinking defense was like the huge flaw in his game, and it's not that big of a flaw. Like he's definitely improving, but there's a lot of room for improvement. Um, it, it's not the end of the world. But as far as Christian Wood and Shangun at the same time, it just hasn't really been working. Uh, but I would like to see it just kind of be tried out, tested out a little more. I mean, Silas, he'll throw it out there for like two minutes. It won't work, and he'll just immediately scrap it, and you won't see it for like another two weeks. So um, he's already come out. He already says, like, I don't play. I don't like playing Shangun and Wood at the same time. And, and that's not good. That's not really good. So... You know, I'm still in the trade Christian Wood camp, but at the same time, this is a 19-year-old kid we are talking about, so uh, there's plenty of time. Like, there's plenty of time. Let me know down below in the comments section what you think Hakeem is going to do for Shangun. I think the Rockets, I mean, I, I feel like we all kind of know this, but um, once he kind of figures out, just once he starts playing a little more efficient, minutes are going to go up, game time's going to be going up, and... Uh, I think we got a gem here so hit the like button hit that sub button if you guys like daily houston rockets content drop some comments down below on shangun and i'll see you guys later